Want to be able to drill up or down in charts and tables to see your data at different degrees of granularity? SAP Analytics Cloud Hierarchies will take your analysis and planning activities to a whole new level. In models and datasets, certain types of dimensions, such as date dimensions, are automatically structured as hierarchies so you can navigate from annual results to quarterly or monthly. But beyond those, SAP Analytics Cloud also lets you create your own hierarchies for any generic dimension. Level-based hierarchies, which are based on multiple columns of data, can be created in both models and datasets. In a dataset, when you construct your hierarchy by defining a name and choosing the columns you want to occupy each level, it results in a new hierarchy object plus individual dimensions for all the columns that make up the hierarchy. When you create a level-based hierarchy while preparing data in a classic model, on the other hand, the dimensions at the top of the hierarchy become property columns of the dimension at the bottom. In other words, once the model has been saved, state and region are no longer dimensions, but are instead columns in the location dimension. You can create new multi-level hierarchies after a model has been saved by adding property columns and using them to generate your level-based hierarchy. The option to create this type of hierarchy is available only after you've added at least one additional property column to the dimension. In models, you can also create parent-child hierarchies, which are hierarchical structures that use only two columns. When you create this type of hierarchy, a new column is added in which you specify the parent of each dimension member. In the product dimension, for example, you can create a parent-child hierarchy by adding product subcategory and category members to the dimension, and then specifying the parent for each dimension member. With the top level identified as the root. If you want, you can create multiple parent-child hierarchies for the same dimension, such as an alternative product hierarchy that skips the subcategory level to provide a simpler structure. Once you've finished creating your hierarchies, you can view and edit them here, and click and drag the members to reorder them if necessary. Keep in mind that in your stories, where multiple parent-child hierarchies are available for a dimension, the first hierarchy displays by default. You can change the active hierarchy here. For more information on how to set up hierarchies in SAP Analytics Cloud, check out the links in the description and try it for yourself today.